I've threatened to make a video of this for ages. I'm going into the preserve and it looks like I have to walk through a river. There is no way out, so such is. I don't know if we're gonna see anything. Apparently they repaved this. I haven't been down here in a long time. I have a umbrella. It just rained like fucking hell. It was horrible. It rained so bad. And I wanted to see if the stream or river or whatever you call it is like overflowing. And it seems quite calm. But here, here it is. See all that? Let me put the umbrella down. Let me see how I, far I can get down here. It's pretty yuck over here. Ooh, that should be all right. That's the storm drain runoff. That's what I wanted to see. <laughs> That's the storm drain runoff. This is where it goes. Out there is the street. There's more further down. I think I might as well just take a walk now. It smells so fresh and so nice in here. With all the medjinbalation. Sorry, Chalky. <laughs> I think you were the one who actually wanted to see this, as a matter of fact. Yeah, the water's kind of high over here. Some stuff floating. I don't know if you can tell. But, uh, yeah, that's moving. It is pretty high up, I guess. Some rapids here. <laughs> yeah, it's moving. Yeah, we got some high water here. Um, usually it's never up to the concrete going across here. It's never up to this point. In fact, that area there where it's down creates, it, it, this concrete makes almost like a dam and allows the water to flow over that. And there's usually, oh, three or four more steps visible there. <laughs> you just, you can't today. I mean, you know, you can walk across it. It looks very, very murky, though, probably because of all the rain and that. Uh, I, I've been in this when it's perfectly clear, and it's, it's gorgeous. I don't know where the water really originates from. It would be north from here. This water is flowing in a southwardly direction, or a southbound direction, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. Um... And eventually this would go out to probably the bay and then eventually into the Atlantic Ocean if it can get through the, the inlets there, if it were to. But where it begins up north, I, I don't really know. I'm going to keep going for a bit. I don't remember. It's been a number of years since I've been in here, so I don't remember how long it is to the next... Uh, rainwater inlet so we'll see I'll keep going you would think since that leads up to the road that here would be another inlet but there's not but further up is that area up there that I can't explain it's just the the rest area well shit not only have they been here for graffiti But there was a bench here, which it still is. And there was one here, which is gone, because I think the snowplow ran into it, or some motor vehicle ran into it, I don't know. But look at this move here. This is Chuchin. From up there. And there's the red graffiti building. And it chooches out onto here. 
And the other thing that bothers me a bit is that it looks like it lost a thing here because this railing doesn't do much good without a mid thing like these all have. Watch the weeds. That was rather interesting. Kind of looks almost like an aggulator is going to come out and stuff. Um, I don't know if there's anything else here. I don't think there's anything to see to the right here. It's just all weeded out. There's actually a guy on his bike here. How about that? So, I don't know where there's another inlet for the rain, but I did show you the one by me. I'm going to head back now, and maybe I'll get another video of that. It's actually raining now. That was from where I just was. Down to over here. This is a stream gauging station. So, <laughs> they just write the website on there. That's high tech, isn't it? Wow. Yeah. Look at that water go down there. That is moving fucking quick. And then it sort of pools over here gives you the white water rapids and then goes down again and then heads out so it's really really moving here unfortunately there's a bottle under that rock somebody threw in there so I guess that's just stuck there forever because if this water ain't taking it out it's pretty rare that we have this kind of runoff pretty rare alrighty so let me start heading back and we'll take one more look at the inlet. There was the elusive Bougain V bird. He always knows when a camera comes out. There was one right on the grass here. I hear him. He's in there. He's not singing now. Is that fecal? <laughs> anyway, I'm back from where I started. <clears throat> I get back down in here. Yeah, it's it's lower than it was. I'll see if I can hold this out a bit. Just so you can see a little more of it. But that's where the water goes. Why it has those notched areas in it, I don't know. Maybe to allow the surrounding soil to uh, percolate into it and, and ultimately drain? I, I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to get rolling. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like. Make sure you click subscribe. And take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.